Hi, and welcome to this edition of Out the Box. I'm Paul Sillers of Firewalls for Now and Firewall News. Uh, today we're going to be looking at the Ubiquiti Unify Switch 16 port, 150 watt power over Ethernet switch. Um, this is not meant to be a technical review, that's not what we do in this. We just literally show you what's in the box. Um, so you get an idea of um, what you're going to get when you order. There's plenty of stock images out there, but it's really nice to get your hands on um, and see what you actually get. So this is it. It's 16 port with uh, two SFPs, 150 watts of total output for power um, over Ethernet. I'm just going to pop it down on the floor so I can just take this outer um, cover off and we can actually have a look at um, the device here. So, like with all of the other Unify things, whether it be um, the access points, video cameras, um, or the Unify um, security gateway, you can manage this all from um, the same piece of software that you can run either on the cloud, Ubiquiti Cloud Key, um, on your own virtual server, or just on um, a local computer um, that you um, run in your property, your house, your office, wherever it's going to be. Um, so, items you're going to get, you're going to get the obligatory um, how to get going, this is how to adopt it into the Unify Cloud and once it's there you can then um, manage it. You're going to get your power supply, in this instance Australian, um, this is an IEC connector, so normal kettle lead, quite simple uh, there. Nice on here, like I said, this is a rack mount um, model, um, the ears are not already put on, um, so they are included in the box, you'll just need to um, add them in with a small set of screws um, that are here. Um, but nicely what they do is they do actually have the rack tabs and bolts. I'm always scrabbling around trying to find those when I get to the rack, so it's nice to actually have a set of four for those. Um, and if you do decide that you want to um, put this as a um, device on a desktop, there are a set of small um, four little um, feet that can be put onto the bottom just to increase the airflow. So let's just get the box, uh, the unit out of here uh, for you so you can actually have a look at it. So there we go, 16 ports, um, and you can see the uh, SFPs there with their covers up at the end. Um, and let me just turn that around so you can have a look. At the back, good specifications, what these support um, in v VLANs um, and all the other configuration options. You can see the console port on the back there, just a single power supply um, in. Now it's very interesting, a lot, and probably one of the biggest questions that we get is how noisy are these, because a lot of these end up going into people's houses, um, maybe small media centres. So what I just thought I'd do for people is we'd actually just power this one up, um, so you can have a listen. Now please bear in mind it's always going to be, um, the, the noise is always going to be related to um, the amount of power this is giving out. So um, if you've got this fully loaded, then you might find the fan spin up, or if in your um, home or in your environment, um, you it obviously running warm because it's in a small media cabinet or something like that. So I'm just gonna hold it up for you. That That's it booting and running. So it has got a, a small amount of sound. The fans do spin down when they're not actually um, needed so once it's completed through its boot cycle it will probably turn slightly quieter um, but hopefully that's been a little bit of a help for you to actually have a look um, this is um, the ubiquity unify uh, switch the 16 port 150 watt uh, version i'm paul sillers of firewalls for now on firewall news hopefully that's been helpful in this edition of out the box